Uh, so hi everyone. Today we're talking about how you can integrate different types of AI agents, be it Auto GPT or Baby AGI or Hugging Face GPT using LangChain. So in this particular demo, we'll be demonstrating uh, the integration of three major AI agents. Uh, that is Hugging GPT or you can say Jarvis. Other uh, is Baby AGI and last one is Auto GPT. So let's get started. So first of all, we'll be pip installing a few packages: Diffuser, LangChain, OpenAI. This particular version is required. Because else for auto GPT, I remember uh, they, there were some issues. So for OpenAI, you need to have this version 0.28, LangChain Experimental and Accelerate. Now, once you are done with this, we will be first of all integrating Hugging Face GPT, right? So let's get started. So first of all, from LangChain Experimental, we'll be importing Hugging Face G Hugging GPT. So what is Hugging GPT? I've already explained in previous videos, but I will just brief a bit here also. So basically, it's the integration of LLMs uh open a with hugging face so eventually the lm would be taking a decision and then using hugging face models to implement take an action so i will be showing you what uh, actually it means and how powerful it becomes so uh, if you have an api key you need to provide this api key here uh, or set it as an environment variable for uh, in your system once you're done with this we'll be loading a few tools a uh, document questioning, uh, question answering, image captioning, image question answering, image segmentation. There are multiple things now you can do with an LLM with this integration because Hugging Face has a lot of models with it. So eventually, uh, whatever things that you are not able to do with GPT 3.5 Turbo, now you can do it with the integration of Hugging Face by using GPT 3.5 Turbo only because GPT 3.5 Turbo would be given directions and then choosing a model presented Hugging Face according to the question. So these are all the things that you can do. As you can see, image transformation, text download, text to speech, text to image, text to video. Most of the thing, I think almost all the things uh, you can do using Hugging GPT. So once you have loaded these tools, you need to create a Hugging GPT object in which you need to pass the LLM object that is using OpenAI and the tools. Now the first question that I'm asking this agent is to please show me an image of a dinosaur dancing alongside a relatable coat. So the image has been created. So uh, it takes uh, it took me a lot of time because the models, all models, were getting uh, downloaded. As you can see, 3.5 GB, and then the inference time was also high. That is, I'm not doing it live, but eventually you'll see the results. So here you can see that it has created an image of a dinosaur alongside a quote written in the image itself. The second question that I asked this agent write a note on India. So that's easy. So it is able to write the note also. So eventually you need to try to understand that using Hugging GPT, the domain, uh, the very, uh, the diversification of LMs becomes huge. They have a bigger domain now. They can do almost anything. Uh, image, they can interact with multi-model stuff as well. Images, audios, and videos. They can do er uh, everything now and not just text. The next model, the, uh, the next agent that we'll be integrating is Baby AGI. So I already explained in previous videos uh, a demonstration on Baby AGI. So Baby AGI is also a very powerful autonomous AI agent. Basically, it is not able to execute commands as Auto GPT, but eventually, uh, once you get with a task, it breaks the task automatically and then keeps on updating the list depending upon the priority. So we will see a demo for that also. So first of all, to use this, we need to have a vector DB with us. So I've already explained vector, what a vector DB is also. So you can refer to my previous video. So the vector DB that we are using is pass hyphen CPU and then we need to pip install tick token as well. Then eventually as mentioned, you can uh, input all the required packages. As you can see that all these autonomous agents are present in the LangChain experimental package and not in LangChain. Do remember this. Even Hugging GPT was in LangChain experimental, Baby AGI is also in LangChain experimental. Once you are done with this, you need to create an embeddings model using OpenAI embeddings. Then eventually you need to set up the vector DB also. What embeddings you need to use and which vector db we are using so we are using fast as you can see we are setting an embedding size also now using bbj dot from llm function we are providing the llm we are providing the vector store object that we have created using fast verbose if you wish to keep verbose like uh, you want to see the output uh, in the output window you can do that max iterations once you are done bbj you need to provide the objective so the objective that we are providing is prepare a report on water preservation now, as you can see that it is making a, first of all, uh, if you have seen a previous video on Baby AGI, 
maybe they first of all creates a list of sub tasks so as you can see the task list it is creating and then eventually automatically will prioritize this task also okay which task i should be doing first and then keep on updating this list also so this is huge that is why i just uh stopped it midway but you can see that uh, the logs are here and then there is a keyboard interrupt because i did it uh, uh because a limitation with bbj is that you can't stop it midway it keeps on going infinitely until unless it is stopped so it will give you all the outputs in the output window only it is not saving those also so this is a limitation baby aj not talking about the last and the most important uh, ai agent that is auto gpt so we will talking about how you can integrate auto gpt using lang chain in your now here you are setting the open api key in uh, search api key if you have already set up in the previous uh, in the first demo hugging gpt no need to do this again now we are creating multiple tools that we will be using with auto gpt if you have referred to my if you have seen my agents with lang chain so i think you must be aware with what are tools in lang chain so these are uh, external third party tools third party facilities that you can provide your llms so here we are providing it with three uh, three tools one is a search tool uh, using which the llm can search in the internet one is a write file tool that which gives it a facility to write in the uh, in the memory and the read file tool i think the rest of the code is almost remains the same as baby agi we are setting up a vector db using fast and then auto gpt dot from llms and tools we are naming the agent as raju ai role is assistant tools we are giving the list of tools llm chat open ai and memory is vector store now we are also setting up the verbose as true now almost the same thing we are asking it to prepare a question for class 10 biology and save as pdf now in case of bbj we are not asking it to save because it can't do it in case of auto gpt it can do it it also goes very long as you can see that so i have stopped at midway but yeah this is how you can integrate hugging face G hugging gpt baby agi and auto gpt with langchain and uses your jupyter notebooks or python scripts